Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki of the Apostleship of Prayer. And as Pope Francis continues his pastoral visit to the East African country of Uganda, I'd like to share with you part of a message that the bishops there wrote, encouraging their people to prepare for his visit. They wrote, We are beset by challenges to which we, as church, need to pay particular attention as we await the visit of His Holiness the Pope. We draw your attention to the alarming gap and contradiction between the faith we profess and the life we live, between the gospel and some traditional African practices such as polygamy, cohabitation, trial marriage, witchcraft, and human sacrifice. While many Catholics recognize the sacredness of marriage, many are non-compliant to the demands of Christian marriage. The family is also affected by infidelity, denial of mutual love, domestic violence, underage marriage, poor communication among spouses, excessive dowry, child abuse, poverty, alcoholism, and diseases, especially HIV AIDS. Before the Holy Father comes, we are challenged to recommit ourselves to promoting the values and sanctity of marriage and the family, and to rebuilding the moral fiber of our country. I couldn't help thinking that while those words were addressed to people on the other side of the world, to a people with a very different history and culture than our own, they ring true just as much for us. We too have an alarming gap and contradictions between the faith we profess and the life we live. Pope Benedict called this a practical atheism, where we don't deny God's existence, but simply live as though God doesn't matter. As we pray for Pope Francis on his African journey, let's commit ourselves to living our faith courageously in our own circumstances.